In this video, I will show you how to fix a common error for structured data in MPase. The error is image size is smaller than recommended size. So now we're gonna figure out why that error occurred and we're gonna go jump in our search console and I will show you how to fix that. First, we need to know how to find that error. And the answer for that is Google Search Console. There we're gonna find a set of tools and reports that will help us to identify errors and improve our page on the Google search result. And when we talk about articles and images inside articles, we need to follow a set of rules. First, we need to use only images that are directly related to the article that we are creating our structured data. Secondly, that image should be at least 1200 pixels wide. That rule particularly is totally related to the error that we're gonna fix today. But let's see what are the other rules that we need to follow as well. The other rule is every page must contain at least one image. And Google will pick the best image to display on the search based on the aspect ratio and resolution for that image. In other words, just provide the best image in something that is totally related to your article. Image URLs must be crawlable and indexable. Image must represent the marked up content. So what that means is that the image should represent the content that you are sharing. And the file format must be supported by Google Image. You need to use the formats recommended to the web, PNG, JPEG, and WebP. And the last item of the list, provide multiple high resolution image with the following aspect ratio, 16 by nine, four by three, and one by one. If you wanna know more about those rules, there is a link at the description that you can check all the items needed for the structured data related to articles. And now let's jump to our search console and see the steps to fix that error. Here inside my Google Search Console, I have the overview over my end page. At the moment, I have zero errors, but I still have 12 issues on my website. And the first item is the item that we're gonna learn how to fix it. I will just click on there and I will have the list of all the pages that have the same error. If I wanna get more description about those pages, I have two options. I can copy the link, I can open that specific page in a new tab, and also I can inspect that URL. But for now, I already created the image with the size that is expected that is 1200 pixels wide. So, and here we are at the blog post that we're gonna fix it. I will just click on edit post and inside the editor, I will just jump to the feature image and I will just upload an image with the requirements for that item. So I will select that image, set as my feature image, update my post, click on view post, just to confirm if our image is there, I have my feature image selected. I'm expecting to use that image to be displayed on the search or any type of situation. Now I will just jump to my Google search console at the page that we saw the error before. I will just click on inspect. So here the error is still appearing. One thing that you need to double check is when that item was crawled. As you can see here, we are at 24th of January and the last time that the content was crawled was yesterday. With that situation, I will just to ask to crawl my site again. I will just click in test live URL and waiting to my content be updated and recrawl. Now we have the last test that was now in my page, it's valid without errors. As you can see here, everything is fine. Our job is done here, but if you need any help with the end plugin, please contact us at the support forum, link at the description below. Thanks for watching and see you next time.